all or nothing! In Goku's pathetic land-based soul. Do I punish you? Heavenly Tempest! Round after! Top gun hit! Farewell. From the land of the living, I call upon thee in the land of the dead to unleash thy fury of thunder! Working on it, okay? We must be merciless. Engulf these pathetic Punish me! Rising! Punish 
the yeah. circle of eternals on the land of the living. I call upon thee in the land of the dead to unleash thy fury of thunder.
Let's reveal your destruction! Let's keep on going! Punish 
punishment. <laughs> Depart. What a charge! We won! This place seems different from the other places we've seen so far. Ah! What's going on? Ah! No way! 
Don't worry about us. <gasps> the Darrow's emblem. Lloyd! Everyone! What just happened? Amazing. The others must have had the Darrow's emblem. What's the Darrow's emblem? What does it mean if they had it? The Darrow's emblem was created on the world of Darrow's Carlon. It utilizes any mana surrounding it to protect its owners. Protects its owners? But they weren't protected at all! That is because you, as Lord Ratatosk, were purposefully avoiding a visit from the owner of the Darrow's emblem. I was? Yes. Long ago, you gave the Darrow's emblem to a young half-elf boy and his companions. But you were betrayed by them. So Ratatosk set a trap in case the owner of the Darrow's emblem ever came here? Correct. The others are imprisoned somewhere within this place. The only one who can save them is Lord Ratatosk. That is to say, you, Lord Emil. I understand. Let's hurry and look for them. Right. They've saved us so many times. Now it's our turn to repay the favor. Welcome, everyone, to the Monster Graveyard. So, you came all the way here, kid. Dex. There's no reason to do this, Alice. You two were just being controlled by the power of the Centurion's core. Can't you see that? Who said anything about me being controlled? The commander in Dumbo Dex, perhaps. But I always knew exactly what I was doing. What? I was perfectly sane when I fought you. Because after all, Mart Mart, I totally despise you. But... why? You're just so annoying. You're powerless, and yet you always have to interfere. Stop it, Daddy! Please help me, Ratatos! Fooey! You can't solve anything by yourself. You're so pathetic, it makes me sick. Maybe that was true before, but... I hate hypocrites like you. I couldn't wait to rub your cute little nose in the sad truth of what you really are. I knew if I stayed close to Richter, you'd come to me eventually. Dex. The entire blood purge incident in Palma Costa. You're the one who's responsible for it, aren't you? Yeah. Why? Even if you wanted to save the people of Silverot, how could you do that? The only one I'd fight for is Alice. If she were to ask me, all she'd have to do is say the word. I'd sell my soul to the devil for her and never look back. I'm going to gain unyielding power. That's what's needed to survive this world. If Richter calls upon demons, I'll use them as well. The world will answer to me and only to me. So, to complete my deal with Richter, I need you to die. Now just give up and die. How can you hurt? Other 
her so easily. How can you hurt Marta? You think you're some kind of knight in shining armor, kid? I won't let you hurt Alice. I don't care if you hate me, Alice. Why can't you realize that it's wrong to turn the world into a demonic realm just so you can gain power? Why is it wrong if the world is turned into a demonic realm? No matter what the world turns into, I will survive and persevere with my own power. I will stand right by Alice. Swallow for me! Have a taste of this! I am not gonna end here! 